Winter is coming, autumn is here, and for that we must prepare with some cold weather sewing items. And for that I have 15 free sewing patterns for you for this cold season. It ranges from transitional pieces to dead of winter cold pieces. So without further ado, if you like this video, make sure to like it. And if you want to see more content like this, make sure to subscribe. And let's just get into the patterns, shall we? All right, I'm going to go through these patterns in closet order, if you will. So starting with shirts, I have this amazing shift top from fabricstore.com. It is called the Taylor Linen Swing Blouse Pattern. It is super cute, and as you can see here, it's done up in like this mustard linen. So it's really giving me fall vibes. It'd be very easy to extend the length of the sleeve to full length if you didn't want the quarter length sleeve. And it's very easy to adjust. Like you can just make the ruffle part longer and make it a dress. So I feel like it's a very great piece in general. All right, up next is a tried and true favorite of the sewing community. It is the Monroe turtleneck. I've talked about this before in my gift ideas video that I made for the last holiday season. This is awesome. It sews up so quick. It is so comfy and it's just a great all around pattern for layering for the fall or winter. Speaking of layering pieces, this is the quilted vest pattern by Pearl Soho. Pearl Soho has amazing patterns for knitting, crochet, sewing, and they have a ton of free patterns. But I picked this one because, first of all, quilted jackets are very hot right now, and a quilted vest as well. This would be very easy to like add a tie to in the front, and it's just a great layering opportunity for the uh, fall and winter time because it keeps you warm. And it seems like a really simple and straightforward introduction into quilting, if that's something that you wanted to do. All right, breezing right through these, we're coming onto jacket territory. Love it. And our first jacket is a very cool jacket. I want to make this jacket. And it is the jacket pattern number 741 by Grasser Patterns. And this is so cute. I'm loving the fabric that they use, the tie at the waist, the pockets and the puffiness of this jacket. It is very trendy and very fashionable. Moving on to our next jacket pattern. This is the Paola workwear jacket pattern. I have mentioned this before. I mentioned it in my autumn sewing plans video and I'm currently working on it now. This is also another tried and true favorite of the sewing community. It's easy to hack, to add pockets to. It is unisex so you can make it for whoever you want. It's got your classic like workwear jacket with a boxy fit. It's just all around great and it seems like a great pattern to start with if you're wanting to make a jacket. All right, moving on to a more durable winter jacket. This is the Hazel Coat by Mood Fabrics. This would be great paired with like a flannel or wool coating. It's a bit longer and it's got pockets in the front. I thought that this would be a great pattern to start out with if you're wanting to make a winter coat because you have a lot of flexibility and the amount of warmth that you can get from the fabric choice. So, all right, our last free jacket pattern is the Dean jacket. It's a menswear sewing pattern by Mood Fabrics. However, I think it would be great for anyone. Obviously, like I like to include a lot of menswear into my wardrobe. But this reminded me of like a members only jacket, kind of a 80s style bomber jacket. I guess it's named after Mr. James Dean and I think it's really cool. All right, moving on to the bottom half of our bodies. I have a really fun addition to this video and it is the Clyde Work Pant by Elizabeth Suzanne. And I have been waiting for this pattern for a very long time. Elizabeth Suzanne released some of her patterns into the wild kind of early 2020. And I totally missed it. I like <laughs> didn't know that it existed, never got any of them. And I have been l lusting after people's version of this Clyde work pant on Instagram. Um, it's got a very unique like side pocket and you can really like this would work as a loungewear pattern or an actual workwear pattern out of like a canvas material. So this is a pay what you can price point. So while free, it is an option and you can do it. You can obviously also donate whatever amount of money you feel comfortable with. So I had to include it and I am very excited to make myself a pair. All right, up next in the bottoms category, I'm sharing with you guys the Ren jeans from Mood Fabrics as well. 
and it is a bell-bottom jean as you guys know fashion is cyclical and it's all coming back um 70s are really in wide bell-bottom and wide pant is very in right now so these are a high waist tight through the leg and bell-bottom pant and the construction looks fairly simple so i feel like if you are intimidated by making a pair of pants this is a great place to start because it's only got two front pockets, two back pockets, and the design is really cool. All right, one of my favorite things to do in colder weather is be inside and sit on the couch and watch a movie or knit or soak up some huga with a cup of tea. And what do you do that best in? A pair of sweatpants, honestly. I found this free pattern for women's joggers and it seems like it'd be very easy to modify and it just seems really cozy. If you wanted a looser pair, it'd be really easy to do because you just size up the pattern and it's elasticated at the waist. So as long as you make the elastic the size of your waist, it'll always fit. And I think everyone needs a good pair of joggers in their life. Also can be worn, I guess, to um, work out if you're into that sort of thing. <laughs> I also picked out this pocket skirt from Peppermint Magazine. They offer free sewing patterns. They have a ton to choose from, but I chose this one specifically because it would be great to layer in the fall and winter with maybe tights and boots or very easy to lengthen the skirt. Um, but it also seems like very easy construction. It'd be a great beginner project because again, it's got an elasticated waist and two side patch pockets. This was designed for Peppermint Magazine by Paper Theory Patterns. I love the collaborations that Peppermint does with these designers because it kind of gives you an opportunity to try out their patterns for free, which is amazing. On to full body ensembles. I have the Cora half sleeve dress pattern for you from Fabric Store. It has a half sleeve, but again, it could be very easily lengthened to a full sleeve or short sleeve and it is kind of a looser bodice with a gathered skirt um, to complete the dress and it would be very great to layer great for an event it's very transitional like you can work outside in it you can chill inside you can go to a wedding i imagined it would be really cute layered with a turtleneck underneath and a, or a jacket over with some tights and a boots and a boots all right on to another peppermint magazine sewing pattern. This is the Milton Pinafore. It was designed for Peppermint Magazine by one of my favorite designers, Just Patterns. It's giving me Queen's Gambit. I'm really excited about making myself one of these. It would also be very easy to, instead of adding a skirt, you could add pants and make it a jumpsuit. But this is a great layering piece and I imagine it in you know a wool blend, gingham and or tartan fabric and I feel like it would be so cute and very dark academia vibes and you can technically wear this without anything underneath it if you're feeling flouncy <laughs> whatever that means all right and I have to finish off this 15 free patterns I have a couple of accessories and that starts with the keyhole scarf from Pearl Soho I've seen this style of scarf quite a bit and I like how unique it is it seems like a great introduction to making a welt hole, aka like welt pocket hole, that you shove the other end of the scarf through. It seems like it would be very, very warm, especially for those of you who live in really cold climates. Thought it would be so cool and stylish to make a scarf like this one. And last but not least is this scrunchie tote by Cool Stitches. While making it fit your season is a matter of the heart, um, I love this tote. It is fully lined. It has a small inside pocket and it is also on the pay what you want scale. So while you can get it for free, you can also choose to pay for this designer's hard work. So I wanted to include it here. I feel like it's just perfect to get on the subway, your little book, your little snacks. Maybe you've got a knitting project going on. You're taking it to the park. Listen, it has endless opportunities and endless possibilities here. Um, but I'm imagining you can make it out of like a thrifted wool tartan blanket, out of some corduroy, or whatever you want. Well guys, I hope that you enjoyed that list of 15 free cold weather patterns. Um, I hope that you choose to make some of them for this fall and winter. And please let me know below what you choose to make and what you're going to download. And I will see you guys next time. Make sure to subscribe if you want to see more.
Bye.